presentation of TFNN. The Tom O'Brien Show is produced every business day. Tom takes your phone calls toll-free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Let's go to Eddie in Boca Raton. Hey, Eddie, what's going on? Hey, Tom, how are you, man? I'm doing great, man. Yourself? Good, good. It is a treasure to have TFNN every hour during the trading day to be there to help you, to guide you, and even to give you some peace of mind or like that, that somebody else is there with you while you're, while you're trading this crazy market, either well, up or down. Well, listen, we appreciate you growling and prowling with us out here because we wouldn't be out here, folks, if we didn't have all you guys, gals, tigers and tigresses as clients. And, you know, the market teaches you every single day, man. Now, Tom O'Brien. Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day on the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. It's a TGIF, folks. Let's make it a great one. Accept others the way they are. You cannot change other people. So try to change them. To fit what you want them to be is like trying to change a dog into a cat or a cat into a horse. They are what they are, and you are what you are. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 210, NASDAQ up 12, SPs up 16, gold contract up $25, trading 18, 17, 70 an ounce. You got silver up 27 cents, $24, 19 cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up 254. Trading out at $81.34 a barrel, notes and bonds. The 10 year note up 17 ticks, trading 131.27. The 30 year up one full point plus 25 ticks at 162.29 in King Dollar. King Dollar is down 75 ticks, trading 94.272. Euro is 115. Yen's 113.40. And the British pound is at 134 to 1 US dollar. iPhone number is 877 927 6648. Give us a call, folks. One that's going on in your world. In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? We get all the indices at all-time highs, folks. So, the SPY, up today, you're at uh, up a buck 50. You're at 468.44. We get into the NDX 100 intraday. Uh, you had a little sell down on this NDX. Bottom line, <laughs> they bought every dip out here, folks. Uh, the Q's right now, the Q's are trading up 24 cents. You're at 398.49. You made it to 404. If you had it, man, Mr. Basil Chapman, man, I, I wish that would just hit 400. I, those even numbers were just a mind blow. Bottom line, though, higher price. Gold. Gold contract for Friday, folks. Bottom line, you got an ABC structure in the way up. The equities are already in an ABC structure. Well, they're in a potential ABC. Royal Gold is in an ABC. That took out the B point, took it out with volume. That gold contract also took out the B point, took it out with volume. Now, let me show you something on the, on the gold contract because intraday, you could have picked this up pretty easy. Uh, actually, hold it. Oh, uh, no, we don't have an ABC up because 815 has too many. Yeah, we don't have. Okay, so when we went up there at 815, um, 1815, uh, on the 27th of October, yeah, you, you did 300,000 contracts. So we're going to do, we do 268 today. Bottom line, you have higher price, but you don't have an ABC structure on the way up because you don't have enough volume. We'll see how this baby shakes out. 1836, that's, that's my take. That's where we're going. Uh, if we go take a look at the uh, silver contract out here, we take a look at silver. What we have with silver, silver's up 28 cents. That is trading out here. Also a nice setup. Uh, 66,000 contracts. That's going to be going after... The B point, the B point on silver is 24.92, and if silver does get that, that's going to be a monster A to B equals C to D. It's a 350, which would get you up to the, about the 27 dollar area inside of the silver market. So it's it's one big number. There's no two ways about that. We go into the uh, note and bond market. So note and bond market, folks, higher price, lower yield. That's the bottom line, and in, in, in a huge way too. So we take a look at the 10 year first. You're going to see the 10 year. We've done uh, 1.7 million contracts. 1.8 now, 
uh, bottom line is that there's a clear line right up to ICE. So ICE inside of the 10-year is laying out at 132.25. That's another full point on the 10-year. We go take a look at the 30-year because the 30-year leads out here. There's no two ways about that. That's how it normally works anyway, fundamentally. So the 30, oh, look at this, man. Oh, this, okay, so check this out, folks. This is a heads up for us. So the number I just gave you on the 10-year, uh, let me do this one first. Well, the number I gave you on the 10-year, if I, if I was giving you a number on the 30-year, that would have been saying that the 30-year would be 161.09. And guess what? You're at 163. It blew by ice. This is, this is saying, guess what? You are going to 165.12, and uh, we'll find out from there. Let me pull this up. This is going to be cool. One second. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to do now uh, a continuous contract on a longer basis and see where we stand here. Okay, so let's see. Oh, I see. We got a lot longer to go. Okay, it's no big deal. Yeah, we're at 163. I don't know if that spike high was at 200 or not, but the last high in uh, what was that February of 2020. That was uh, 182. So right right now, I suspect we're going to 167. We'll, we'll see how that shakes out. The uh, oh, I know what I want to show you. The gold contract intraday. So what you had out here this morning, folks. Okay, is that the gold contract took out a B point of an ABC structure on the way up intraday this morning, and it was it was a beauty too. So where are we here? Here it was right here, I believe, right there. I had 1815. I'm trying to figure out where I did, where I got that from. Almost looks different than I'm looking. At. Oh, there it is. Okay, that's what I did. Okay. So what, what happened? It's a, it's a two-day A to B. That's what's going on. The 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 B point out here was 1800. Uh, you blew it away with volume, and that gave you an 1815 A to B equals C to D. Um, you know, you got it, and you got it in spades. So it's pretty cool. Some of the higher volume equities out here today. We have uh, Ford Motor Companies down five cents. You got Pfizer up uh, 4.25. Peloton, uh, big number there. That's down 29 dollars. Getting smoked. Looks like to me it's going to actually go further down. Madeira is down 52. You get Bed Bath and Beyond up 195. Carnival Cruise is up 190. You have uh, Apple flat. Uber Technologies is up two bucks. Merck's down eight. Norwegian Cruise Lines is up two. Uh, if we go over to, uh, let's see, Airbnb, 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 that had a nice bid out here today. Uh, that came in with some numbers. That's trading 199.97, and that's that's a that's a big move. And I'll show you something with, you know, the the cool thing about the Airbnb one. And keep this in mind in the future, folks. Okay, is that, you know, Mar Marriott had come out with numbers before Airbnb. Marriott come out with numbers on Wednesday. They were great numbers. It went higher with volume. Bottom line, that's important to understand. Why? Because when you're talking about the same sector, Airbnb is the de facto uh, hotel operation. Uh, and, you know, it worked out here, meaning that if you saw what Marriott was doing, you know, you might have got into Airbnb on a short term basis. Dow Industrials right now up 219, the Nasdaq's up 18, SP's up 17 and a half. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. Are you looking for a way to consistently add winning trades to your portfolio? Tom O'Brien is here to help. Tom O'Brien has been successfully trading markets for over 30 years. A frequent contributor to TD Ameritrade Network and CNBC, Tom O'Brien founded TFNN over 20 years ago to help educate investors just like you. Tom's daily market newsletter, Market Insights, is published every morning when the markets open to give you the competitive informational edge you need to succeed. These newsletters are packed full of Tom's advanced technical analysis and are geared to deliver comprehensive strategies for a successful portfolio. Get Tom O'Brien's newsletter, Market Insights, today and try all of our products and newsletters 30 days risk-free with our money-back guarantee at TFNN.com. TFNN, educating investors. What's separating you from the most successful men and women on Wall Street? That's right, information. Having all the information gives us the perspective we need to place the right trades at the right time. 
The TESS Profile Scanner is the premier market profile-based scanner. Powered by its acclaimed TESS proprietary algorithms, this feature-rich scanner instantly filters over 2,500-plus global financial markets, such as stocks, ETFs, commodities, futures, and Forex. This powerful suite of tools leverages instant trade filtering and strategy formulation to show you emerging trades before they happen. For a limited time, you can save $100 off your first month by using the promo code UPGRADE. And you still get a 30-day money-back guarantee, so you have nothing to risk. Level the playing field with the TAS Profile Scanner, which you can find under the Services tab at TFNN.com. Sign up today. Sharpening your skills as an investor is like getting better at playing a musical instrument. You have to practice, sure, but you also need excellent instruction from experts. At TFNN, you'll get advice and guidance from the authority in technical market analysis. And it's not just dry, tedious text, either. TFNN airs live financial content streamed live on TFNN.com and TFNN's YouTube channel with Tiger TV. Live every market day from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern. For free, each host is an experienced trader and gives their take on the market while taking calls and questions live from around the world. From the moment the market opens until the closing bell sounds, Tiger TV has eight different shows with expert hosts to help you make the right moves with your money. Watch online at TFNN.com or on TFNN's YouTube channel and become the investor you were born to be. TFNN, educating investors. Call now, toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. Welcome back, folks. The Dow. Dow is up 207. Nasdaq's up uh, 18. S&Ps are up 16. Let's go inside the Dow Industrials first. See the strength versus the weakness inside the Dow. Uh, strength out here. You got Boeing. Looks like uh, yeah, Boeing's the number. Boeing's up, uh, uh, putting 73 positive points in the Dow. Visa 49. Disney 35. American Express 28. Taken away from it. Merck minus 55. Home Depot minus 21. Amgen minus 12. We go into the NDX 100. We take a look at the NDX, what we have with the NDX out here. Strength versus the weakness. You got bookings.com up 7.5%. Um, Trip.com is up 5.8%. Qualcomm's up 5 Makata Libre is up 4.8%. Uh, Taken away from it. Peloton and Moderna are the big numbers out here. Peloton's down 34%. 34%. You got Moderna down 18%. Uh, Zoom is down 7%. And DocuSign is down 5.6%. Uh, so let's go over to Peloton here because this is no doubt a monster hit. Uh, they were, they were, the, the thing that's amazing about this, folks, is that this was a billion dollars shot in their, their numbers. One billion, okay? You're talking about some monster numbers here. Now, if we take a look at it, you got it. To me, what you have here, wide open, I think, I know this is bad. This, they had a high of 171, but this looks to me like we're going to be going down to 45, 35 on the weekly. Let me put this on a monthly for a second. Yeah, this is going to, oh, this is going to be, okay, here we go. Then ABC down, right from the highs. 171 to 80, 90 bucks. 90, yeah, there it is, 30, that's 30 to 40 bucks. Where's that, right? 40, well, 40 bucks. 40 bucks is the monthly ABC structure on the way down. I mean, it's, it's, a, it's, the, it's a monster number. There's no doubt about that. And when we take a look at the revenue structure inside it, you're going to see, um, oh, this is interesting. They only go by the years. They don't give me the breakdown here. wonder why. Anyway, the bottom line, they didn't come in with the numbers. That's the, and they're losing money. Man, magic, could, could you imagine, folks, so picture this. How the heck, well, we, we know this. Uh, that would be the wrong question. How the heck do you take in $4 billion and lose money? That's what public companies tend to do until they make money. But <laughs> it's amazing. They, so 2021, take in $4 billion and lose 36 cents a share. Wow, that is intense. That is about as intense as you can get. Uh, Airbnb is just the opposite. That, that's going topside. Let's go see what the good old King Amazon is doing out here. Um, Okay, so Amazon gets up to the swing. The swing's 3549. Right now you got 3566. 
it couldn't hold price, but you know what's happening here? So check this out. It didn't hold price, but it had volume. So when you have volume and you get into a swing and you give it up in price, most times you go right back topside. That's how this works, folks, okay? So I expect you're going to see it. See, we're going into 2.7 million, 2.1 million, no, 2.7 million at the high that was generated out here on the 9th of September. Well, we've done 4.1. So bottom line, it'll be right back up there and test it again. Now, what you do have here is this. What you're looking at, that's the supply line. And that supply line is not a large supply line. And what I mean by that is this. You have anyone that bought it from the June, uh, January 5th through February 29th, the reason that would be the supply line is that they bought it at higher price. That's how that works, folks, okay? That, that's how that goes. Uh, let's go take a look at uh, NVIDIA, NVDA, and what the question is on v NVIDIA. Let's see. Um, oh, cool. Okay, so we'll do that. Um, the what the Tiger wants to know is that and inside NVIDIA, who's been buying NVIDIA? We know it's a rocket ship, okay? There's no doubt about that. So we're going to get dig into the 13F filings. And if you're watching Tiger TV, these are right up on my screen. So what happens with a 13F filing, folks, okay, is that whether it's a large fund or a large owner, as they buy into it, they basically have to update what they're doing. And in this case, uh, let's see, so we're on November 5th today. So what you're always looking for when you're doing this is that you're looking for something that's really close. We're not looking for the 630s because we know what happened on 630. That's the end of that quarter. 930 right there. Well, Bank of New York. You know, because that's September 30th. That, that'd be a new one. And then there's not, there's not much there, man. You know? And then the cells, 930, UBS. Yeah, so there's, there's not as much as you as would think that it would be. That's, that's the bottom line. Let's go take a look at the GDX out here, a few of these gold equities. GDX right now, you know, it, the market didn't hold price yesterday. And, and th so this is, this is kind of... No, this is exactly like I was talking about, that you go to higher price and it doesn't hold. So what we had out here yesterday is this, folks, okay? None of the gold equities held, the, the, the metal did. See how GDX had volume yesterday? It's up with 26 million, gets to a price point of, of uh, $32.65, doesn't hold price. Today, you're right back up to that level. Bottom line, you're up 87 cents. Now, if we put this on a weekly, you're going to see it's a really sweet setup. So, so watch on the weekly. Watch this. Three weeks ago, we had strength inside the gold and silvers. You went topside with 123 million. We came back down. We tested that area with 81 million, and you rejected price. This is this is really sweet. 81 million to 123, folks, is a monster number. This thing's going to go after the B point. I expect the GDX, we're going to be up at 40 bucks. Right now, you're at 32.62. And if I look at here, watch this, I'll do a Royal Gold, because Royal Gold is one of the first ones that finally took out a B point and took it out with volume. If we put this on a weekly, let's see what we got. Now, on a weekly, it doesn't say much just because you come off the bottom. So you come off 92, you're at 105. And 109 is where it's going to get some flack, you know. And that 109 is where we went downtown in June. That's where you can basically expect some flack in the business. Let's go take a look at Microsoft and see how Microsoft's setting up. Now, Microsoft has been one of the strongest equities inside of the market. That's still hanging out there, man. 336. It's pretty amazing. And uh, this, this equity has gone up 90, well... Yeah, eighty ninety five dollars in six months. Ninety five dollars, and want to see something, folks? This is which amazing to me. They have seven point five billion shares. In order to move something ninety five dollars with seven point five billion shares, you need such a huge amount of buying. It's incredible. But guess what? That's what's happening out here. Uh, I'm sure the note and bond market's flipping people right out, but guess what? This is lower for longer in a big way. And we take a look. I'll just do this quickly. You know, the rates worldwide, guess what? We're still, we're at 1.43 in the 10-year. And guess what? Germany's in a negative, negative 0.28. The Netherlands, Switzerland, they've always been in. 
they've been in negative forever. Um, yeah, and there it is again. Look at look at Greece. Greece, you know, it, it, I'm sure you remember. Greece was broke, gonna go bankrupt. Who knows? It, all of the above. They're still. Greece can still borrow money at one percent, and we're paying one point four three. These rates are going down, man. That's that's the bottom line. And we'll see where the rest of it shakes out. Dow Industrials right now up one eighty three. Nasdaq up eight. S and P's up thirteen. Come right back, folks. Are you having fun trading the markets, but having trouble finding like-minded individuals to discuss your trading and investment ideas with? Become an apex predator in the trading markets and join the Tiger's Den Trading Room only at TFNN.com. The Tiger's Den is an exclusive trading room where successful traders from around the world come to exchange trades and ideas. Join the den and surround yourself with the sharpest minds in the trading world. Subscribers to the Tiger's Den are also the first to have their questions answered live on air and can privately chat with our TFNN hosts live during their shows. Interact with other Tigers and Tigresses as they share trading ideas, news analysis, and discuss the market action all trading day. Subscribe to the Tiger's Den risk-free with our 30-day money-back guarantee and become part of the TFNN trading community. TFNN, educating investors. You could be making money off the stock market. And if you're already making money off the stock market, you could be making a lot more. Check out TFNN and Tiger TV and get expert investing advice to give you the power to control your financial future. Go to TFNN.com and find the newsletter for you. Whether you're into trading gold, metals, futures, currencies, or options, you'll get advice and analysis to help you seriously get ahead. TFNN also features trading services with a 30-day money-back guarantee for new subscribers, as well as TFNN's Tiger Den Trading Room, trading software, and educational webinars for all trading levels and make sure you check out tiger tv for free on tfnn.com or tfnn's youtube channel for live financial content from 8 30 a.m to 4 p.m eastern on market days stop watching on the sidelines while other people get rich and become the investor you were born to be tfnn educating investors TFNN is excited about our new software charting program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts. In collaboration with Tom O'Brien and using his best-selling book, The Art of Timing the Trade, Your Ultimate Trading Mastery System, David White has programmed an outstanding piece of software that will complement any trader's methodology. Using this first-of-its-kind program, The Art of Timing the Trade Charts allows you to scan thousands of stocks for Fibonacci formation setups, including Gartley's, ABC's, Butterflies, and much more. The Art of Timing the Trade Charts is designed to help you when scouring the markets for stocks just beginning to form the trading patterns that many investors spend days, weeks, or even months searching to find. And right now, we're offering licenses available at only $79 a month. We are so confident that you're going to love this new charting software that will even give you a 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. Don't miss out on this incredible new piece of software. Get your copy of The Art of Timing the Trade Charts today by visiting TFNN.com. This segment is brought to you by Think or Swim. For more information, just click the Think or Swim banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials right now trading up about 192. We get the NASDAQ up 16, S&P's up 14 and a half. Let's go to Robert in Kansas City. Robert, what's going on, brother? Happy Friday. Happy Friday. That's right, man. It's a beautiful day. Totally. So how's yes, life? It is. Oh, it's, 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 hey, I'm, I'm here talking to you. So that's, that's right, that's man. Great. I like it. <laughs> it's only, <laughs> it's so, that's Can you a, do me a favor and look at two mining stocks? One is Vale, V as in Victor, A L E. Yep. Um, I, I like it because it has a nice dividend, but I don't think it's quite bottomed yet. But I've been watching it like a hawk. The only thing. I'll, I'll tell you, it's received a Wells notice from the SEC, and I didn't know what your thoughts is on that. It's probably related to the dam failure a couple of years back. Right, right. 
So let's take a look. So the low, the so Valley folks pays an 11, a 12.9 percent dividend at, at this point. Uh, and when you see these numbers, what do you see these numbers, folks? Okay, these numbers that Valley takes in is insane. So this year, 310 billion with the B, 310 billion. Okay, and this is how they take it in. They take in uh, 149 billion in Asia, 27 billion in Europe, 23 billion in the United States, 7 billion in the uh, Middle East. Uh, Middle East. The um, this and when, you, when you take a look at the description here, now they're the largest. Um, iron ore producer out there. Uh, but what you can see inside this, if you happen to be watching Tiger TV, folks, is that you see in their bauxite, they have aluminum, they have potash, okay? Uh, big numbers. One of the problems that they've had, and then they're based in Brazil, and one of the, then they also have the railroads and the maritime terminals. The problem, you know, here in this downdraft, no doubt, is all about iron ore. Iron ore went through the moon. Uh, when it was through the moon, of course, Valley's out there trading at uh, $23. Now you're $11.65. And let's bring this back. So, you know, let's see. I mean, $10.90, you know, I think it's going to get tested. But you can see as you're coming down, the volume's contracted pretty dramatically, man. Where I'm going, Robert, with this is that that's the highs of the lows that were generated out here in March. You know, the lows uh, six dollars and forty nine cents. The highs ten ninety. Maybe you'll wait to ten ninety. If it rejects low up at prices, you know, what they like, what equities like to do, folks, is this: on high volume spikes, they first go to the high of the low. And if they go to that high of the low and they reject that price and they have lighter volume, that's kind of that's what they do. If they get into that bar, then they'll like to go to the bottom of that bar. So, you know, depending on, you know, your appetite here, um, let's go. Well, let's go look at iron ore because this is all that valley is all about iron ore. So let's see. Iron ore. It's at 577. This is down from like some outrageous number. We're up at 1230. This looks like this might be turning too. You know, I, what, I, what I would do is this. I would wait um, for that lower number, Robert. And the reason I'm saying that is that the, the driving force, well, here, you can actually see it. Here, watch this. The driving force, let's bring it back up again. You see when that revenue breaks yeah, this down? this is something I would look at, like, on a weekly chart for myself just to make sure that it's stabilized before I took a position. No, for sure. Well, you know, if you're watching Tiger TV, see see the revenue? See where it's from? Asia, $149 billion. Yeah. That's all about China. It's all about huge steel buildings. And right. guess what? The bottom line, folks, is that you are going to see a disaster. Well, the disaster is already out here. They're trying to hide it as much as they can. Uh, but those developers up in China, man, there there is there is so many um, loans that they have, and that the the government of China still don't even know that they have. So, so to answer your question, I wouldn't touch it right now. And what was the second one? In uh, Rio, R I O, is it kind of the same category? It is the same. It's the exact same. Really, you're right. So Rio, they're paying a twelve and a half percent dividend. The, Lows 56, the highs 93. There you go. Same deal. China's 25 billion out of the 62 billion. You know, uh, iron ore is the big number there. I, I, well, let's go take a look at it and technically see how this is set up. And they could, even though the dividend looks great, I mean, they could cut that dividend. Yes. Yeah. With Rio, uh, 49 bucks, man. They're, they're, they're the okay. same setups. I'd be going for the same place, too. Yeah. Well, thank you. I appreciate you taking a look. Okay, man. You have a great one and a safe one. Uh, L-U, let's see. Uh, let's get this one. L-U-M-N. So, Lumen Technologies. They provide digital solutions for home business premises. Uh, the low is $9. The high is 16 It's trading at 14 16 they take in, uh, look at this little company, man. Little company. Oh, my God. I'm not, how did I not know about this company? They take in $5 billion every 90 days, folks. Look at this. 
That's how many employees they have. 37,000. Okay, so let's take a look at this, how this is set up. Oh, look at that thing. Holy cow. So you certainly had a sign of strength yesterday. The stock on Wednesday was trading at $12, gets up to 14, 16. Put this on a weekly. Well, I'm not sure why this is, this is such a uh, volatile stock. I mean, the week of uh, January traded from 11 to 16 and closed at 12. Um, oh, it's CenturyLink. I see. Okay. So it's a phone company, right? Isn't that a phone company, CenturyLink? It is. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this is not a bad setup. This is not a bad setup. That's the bottom line. I mean, if you own, I would, if you own it, keep it. Um, you know, when you get, when you get up, because this, this definitely broke a swing, broke with volume. That's saying that it wants to trade up to this 1545 area. Um, that's how that is set up. Um, yeah, they do almost have a, a monopoly. And what they, what they definitely do have here, here have also is this, is that in smaller communities, folks, that still have millions of people, uh, CenturyLink basically had just about a, uh, a monopoly. That's how it was set up. And they do pay a dividend. Uh, one of the targets, probably, they get an 8% dividend. So uh, that's in there, and that's real. Uh, Apple, we had a question on Apple. Let me see. Uh, let's see. Apple was, uh, come on, where are you? I got to read faster, man. Thank God I took Evelyn Wood reading dynamics, folks, when I was in the third grade. You know what happened? This, this, is, this is a funny story, man. I came home in the third grade with a D in reading, right? And in my household, it was the end of the world. I mean, in a big way. <laughs> so, uh, my mother and father sent me to Evelyn Wood Reading Dynamics. And I'm telling you, it was one of the best things that ever happened to me. And Evelyn Wood at that point was speed reading, folks, okay? And I, I, I literally can speed read. But it was really funny, man. I, I learned it in like, you know, I don't know, six months. And um, it was great. <laughs> uh, yeah, Evelyn Wood Reading Dynamics. I, I'm, okay, so let's see. Apple. We got to look at Apple. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. We take a look at Apple out here. They trade 151. It, now this is this is coming right into uh, resistance too. It's going to need more juice. That's the bottom line. Doesn't look like it's going to have it. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. Are you in the market for buying or selling real estate in the Bay Area, including the surrounding St. Petersburg, Tampa, and Clearwater markets? Tiger Real Estate LLC is a firm that has extensive experience in the Tampa Bay Area. Whether you're looking to sell your current property for maximum value, or you're in the market for a second home or investment property, Tiger Realty has the experience across all areas of real estate in the Tampa Bay area to help buyers and sellers make the most informed decisions across all price levels. From the price you should be paying per square foot in certain up and coming areas to the type of cash flow investment properties are capable of creating, Tiger Real Estate can help you make the best decision when it comes to all areas of the market. Before you make one of the biggest decisions of your financial future, call Tiger Real Estate LA. LC today at 727-329-8322 or email us at tiger at tfnn.com. That's 727-329-8322. Call us today. The technology around us is changing every day. With so much happening, it can seem impossible to keep up with all the information. David White's investment newsletter, The Technology Insider, is designed to give you all the information you need to understand the technology that shapes today's markets and tomorrow's future. David White has made his living staying on the cutting edge of technology. His weekly newsletter will give you specific recommendations for value tech stocks, as well as entry prices, target prices, and stops to set for each trade. Dave delivers his weekly newsletters every Friday with updates throughout the week. You can get the Technology Insider at TFNN.com for only $37.50. Sign up for David's newsletter, The Technology Insider, and get an inside look at everything the technology sector has to offer. Try it risk-free today with our 30-day money-back guarantee. TFNN, educating investors. Biotech is booming, but for how long? 
Whether you think the biotech bull has room to run or has run its course, trade LABU or LABD. Direction's daily S&P Biotech three times bull and bear ETFs. Visit directioninvestments.com slash biotech today. An investor should consider the investment objectives, risks, charges, and expenses of the Direction shares carefully before investing. The prospectus and summary prospectus contain this and other information about Direction shares. To obtain a prospectus or summary prospectus, please contact Direction shares at 866-476-7523. The prospectus or summary prospectus should be read carefully before investing. An investment in the funds is subject to risk, including the possible loss of principal. The funds are designed to be utilized only by sophisticated investors, such as traders and active investors. Distributor Foresight Fund Services, LLC. Call, call now. Toll free at 1-877-927-6648. Internationally at 727-873-7618. I'm O'Brien. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials up 221. We got the Nasdaq up 34. S&Ps are up 18. Our guest today, folks, is Abir Abu Jude. Uh, uh, what she has done, pretty cool. She's uh, built a cloud-based software to empower attorneys to conduct legal affairs. The platform is called LexDoc. It was launched in 2018. It offers a, a legal concierge platform that features cloud-based subscription software solutions where businesses and organizations can conduct all their legal affairs in one secure location. Abir, welcome to TFNN. Thank you. Pleasure to be here, Tom. It's great to, ha great to have you. So tell us about your platform and tell us uh, how you can help small businesses, uh, uh, maybe just even individuals and and attorneys. My understanding is that you can help all of them, right? I can help everybody, Tom. <laughs> I like it. Uh, <laughs> well, actually, to start, I'm part of a thriving technology community. So Lexstock is one of 15 uh, companies that were uh, invited to join the Tampa Bay Wave Tech Women Rising Accelerator. And we're very thankful to JP Morgan and Chase, sponsor of our program. That's one way we are part of a community that is thriving and supporting both businesses and individuals in the Bay Area. That's great to know. Um, That's huge. It is. It is. Yeah. And this type of community also brings other industry leaders. So uh, you've heard some of the news about ARC and Goldman Sachs moving to this neighborhood. So that's great news and they're coming because you have as a community built a technology base that is bringing additional industries that want to support this community um pretty exciting Lexstock, right yeah pretty it exciting is. it is I, you know and i've had a, a, a few people on you know and it's really cool i've been here 25 years now i'm from boston so i saw it happen in boston you know people think Boston was always Boston. And when I was a kid growing up, you know, always a great city. But guess what? It wasn't. Um, I had an office actually in Kendall Square. And that's where the whole biotech act thing started. The, the first the first building at Kendall Square, actually, I, I, I had an office there. So it's amazing how fast, folks, something can happen. And it's happening in the Tampa Bay, uh, St. Petersburg, Clearwater area, you know. I so tell us about LexLock. <laughs> So I love that you said that because I'm from New York and early in my legal career, I was traveling back and forth to Boston. Beautiful, beautiful community, too. Yes. But here it's a budding technology that's bringing a lot of opportunities to the locals as well as businesses. So Lexstock itself is building its own community as a marketplace. OK. And the marketplace is to support businesses and attorneys and how we're doing that is empowering the businesses to stay in charge of their legal affairs how do you do that well you give them tools advanced technology solutions like workflow collaboration project management messaging billing and also connect with other attorneys and the attorneys we give them the tools to build their businesses and grow how do you help an attorney grow? Well, you give them referrals and businesses are the referrals they need. So all the attorney has to do is uh, set up a free profile and wait for opportunities to come their way. I see. So here, so 
what ha th this is a subscription-based business, folks. Okay, so here, look, walk, walk us through it. Let's say I'm an attorney, and I jump on there, and I want to get some business. So I'm, I'm in the Rolodex, but I'm in your platform, and, of course, all attorneys specialize in different things. So is that what we're talking here? So the attorneys have a profile. You can fill out information as much as you like. Yes. There is a way for you to add your picture, you add your specialty area, your education, what your specialty, uh, the type of businesses you'd like to serve. And, uh, you know, you wait for a business to connect with you. And when they connect with you, you know that they're currently in the market looking for exactly the type of services you're providing. So let me so ask you this. So that mm -hmm. let's let's just uh, let's just do um, let's just do uh, mortgage closings, okay? Because I'm really familiar sure. with those, okay? Let's just do. You, you say you're doing refis, and what does happen in Florida, folks, is that people don't use attorneys. I use attorneys all the time, okay? Because I'm from Boston, and I'm just used to it. I don't. Uh, a title company's great, but guess what? I need an attorney too. So let me ask you. So I could go out to like three or four attorneys on your platform and, and price it out. Well, the attorneys, part of their profile, they set their pricing and they give you a sample agreement. So before you even reach out to them, you know what the terms are and you know what the rate is. So if it's somebody that is a little too high for your budget, you don't have to go with them. Which and is great. Yeah, no, that's what I'm asking. That's exactly. cool. Okay, right, yeah. right, right. That's, that's, now, that's opening up a whole deal, folks, because no one ever wants to give you prices. <laughs> that's pretty cool. <laughs> no, you know, because we yep. know most of the time it, it works on a percentage of, you know, what you're refinancing or how much you're getting. Um, that's pretty cool, man. So what do, you, what do you find is the most demand on LexLock? LexDoc, we have... LexDoc, a, sorry. We are industry agnostic. So real estate, mortgages, uh, transportation, healthcare, schools have found our platform to be very helpful, especially any a product, any business that has repeat type of legal work. So okay. if you're doing contracts all the time, you want to stay on top of everything in real time. You don't want to keep calling your attorney to find out what's going on with my case. You want to know what's in your case and what's happening in real time. And that's the advantage that LexDoc gives you. It saves you money on all these phone calls just for updates alone. And it allows you to connect with the attorney in real time, uh, message them, have your file organized, uh, put out all of your legal documents right in front of you so that you can evaluate the performance too. So if you see you have a bunch of deals happening in at the same time, yes. you can see where the attorney is performing and how they're doing. And sometimes, even if the attorney is, is fantastic, the deal may not be worth it for you because it's taking so much attorney time. You might as well kill that one and stay with a more promising deal that you're working on simultaneously. So the, these are the types of decision, business decisions that are made easier when you have your legal affairs in your pocket and you're in charge of them. No, that's that's a great program. I, yeah, I get it. Cause I, what happens is that uh, I'm in the construction business also and I use co-construct. And what happens folks is that I, I believe what Abir is explaining to us, when everything is one, one space, you understand things much more. And I can go back, whether it's a year, two years, I can see what the bids are, I can see where they were, I can see where everything else was. That's, that's impressive. I, I love, because what, what, it, what it gets rid of, it gets rid of emails, it gets rid of texts, and you have everything in one spot, right? I know, you get me, you no, get me. No, that's cool, that, I, 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 when you do, that, that is so cool. Well, listen, this has been a pleasure. Um, the website, folks, is LexDoc, L-E-X-D-O-C-K.com. Abir, thank you very much. You have a great weekend, safe weekend, and we look forward to having you on again. Thank you, Tom. Thank I can't you. wait. Thank you. Okay, have a great one. Have a safe one. Bye-bye. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. Sharpening your skills as an investor is like getting better at playing a musical instrument. 
You have to practice, sure, but you also need excellent instruction from experts. At TFNN, you'll get advice and guidance from the authority in technical market analysis. And it's not just dry, tedious text either. TFNN airs live financial content streamed live on TFNN.com and TFNN's YouTube channel with Tiger TV. Live every market day from 8.30 a.m. to 4 p.m. Eastern for free. Each host is an experienced trader and gives their take on the market while taking calls and questions live from around the world. From the moment the market opens until the closing bell sounds, Tiger TV has eight different shows with expert hosts to help you make the right moves with your money. Watch online at TFNN.com or on TFNN's YouTube channel and become the investor you were born to be. TFNN, educating investors. You might think that if you want to be successful at trading in the stock market, you're going to need a crystal ball. After all, it's impossible to predict the future, right? Like any endeavor in life, before you decide it's impossible, get some advice from the experts. You might find that it's not so impossible after all. For daily market overviews that give you direction on the key indices, selective stocks, and commodities, subscribe to the opening call newsletter at TFNN.com. The opening call newsletter is written by Basil Chapman, creator of the trading methodology known as the Chapman Wave. The Chapman Wave up-down sequence gives you an edge in identifying price turns, finding the peaks and valleys in stock prices. Get the opening call newsletter by Basil Chapman in your inbox every day. First-time subscribers also get a 30-day money-back guarantee. If you're not satisfied, let us know and you'll get a full refund within 30 days of signing up. TFNN.com, educating investors. Are you looking for a secured investment which pays you on a monthly basis? The Tiger First Mortgage Program may be the program for you. The best rate on a five-year CD in the country right now, according to Bankrate.com, is paying 1% per year or $1,000 per $100,000 invested. The Tiger First Mortgage Program pays 7% per year, paid monthly, on secured, high-value, buildable properties in St. Petersburg, Florida. The investment is for four years, paying 7% per year or $7,000 per $100,000 invested. Your investment is secured by high-value real estate in St. Petersburg, Florida. Your investment can be anywhere from $100,000 to $500,000. Do you want to make $1,000 per year on $100,000 invested or $7,000 per year on a secured Tiger First Mortgage? The Tiger First Mortgage Program may be just the program for you. The Tiger First Mortgage Program pays 7% per year, paid monthly. For more information, you can call 877-518-9190. That's 877-518-9190. Don't forget, you can listen to TFNN live on your mobile device 24 hours per day. Go to TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. That's TFNN.com, then hit Watch Tiger TV. Welcome back, folks. Uh, Dow. Dow Industrials right now up 200. We get the NASDAQ up 21. S&P's up 15. Uh, gold stuck, folks, up 25 bucks. Silver's up 30 cents. Good numbers out here, man. No, no two ways about it. Um, yeah, notes and bonds, same deal. Let's go. To, I want to take a look at King Dollar because that is the number for us folks that are in the metal market. Um, King Dollar still is going to be fighting about this uh, 93,729 area. So we're above it. That's, that's the real bottom line. It, it failed at a triple top out here today, you know. That doesn't mean anything, though, folks, okay? The bottom line, we'll see whether it can get down and we can get a failure of the 93,729 area. If we go take a look at the euro, uh, the euro is 60% of the U.S. dollar index. So we have with the euro, euro rejected lower price today at 1.1514. And the pound, let's go look at the pound quick. So the pound got smoked yesterday. That's still lower. That looks like it wants to basically, oh, look at, oh, that's nice, man. Okay. No, the pound got to 134.24, rejected lower price. It has a hammer. That wants higher price. Now let's just get the yen together. And the yen right now, not bad, man. We get action. We get action here, man. The yen went down 42 ticks. That's been consolidating for the last three weeks. That had a breakout going all the way back to uh, September 28th. So we got some action, man. We definitely got some action. If you haven't test driven the gold report yet, folks, go do it. We got ABC structures up all over the place. Just go to our website at TFNN. You can test drive it. If you haven't test drove it before, it's, uh, I believe, 30-day money-back guarantee. That's, that's the real bottom line. Um, we're going to close at all-time highs. Oh, we got to do the IWM. 
the, 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 so what happens with the IWM also, folks, this is where this is always dangerous, is that when you have a commodity bull market, most of the commodity stocks are small caps. And that's why, you know, first you had the oil running it, now with the oil stopped running it, now the gold's are running it, all the small commodity stocks are running it. That's also at an all-time high. Always remember, folks, the bear can claw your heart out, the bull can run you over, and thank God, there's always another trade. Health, happiness, and prosperity. Have a great weekend. Have a safe weekend. Please tell your friends about TFNN. Come back here Monday morning. Tommy kicks us off 9 in the morning. Great show. Go get him, folks. Building wealth.